Hey y'all. Welcome back to the Pink Envelope. I am here today with a mashup video, comparison video on three jewelry subscription boxes. Yes, you heard that right. This is a comparison video on three jewelry subscription boxes. Yeah. We're going to get into all the nitty gritty details on this. This is probably the first time I've ever done a video like this. This is the first time I've really bumped into this to this level. So, Rocks Box, tried and true, rental, rent to own. You can decide what path you want to do. Jewelry subscription box, we'll run through that. Had a subscription to this, them for forever. Ended up with a ton of jewelry. Push the old pause button, but I'm back because that jewelry has worn out. I'm just over it. It's time for a refresh. Got my first box and loved it. Next is YSM Designs, a jewelry subscription box I found on Etsy. Everything is handmade, curated by a designer there. So very different from this mass produced box. We're gonna dive in and look at the quality. First time to experience this box. I'm very excited about it. And this is Emma and Chloe. This is how much of the two times they've charged my credit card I've received of Emma and Chloe. They are a European jewelry subscription company that I worked with a lot in like 2021. Then they reached out and they're like, hey, we're based in Paris. We're shipping to America. We're, we're splitting or something from the parent company drama. We're going to put your marketing efforts on hold. Don't create content for us until we can figure stuff out. Never heard back from them, so I subscribed because I really did like the box. And we'll dive into that. So, I personally am extremely excited about this company, so let's open this box first. As I do on many nights, I was playing on the internet and literally it popped into my head, I wonder if Etsy has subscription boxes? And the answer is they do. I actually ordered a few of them. So I was telling you guys, I've got cool things coming in July. Well, one of those I ordered did not. She's like, no, 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 don't. <laughs> right now I cannot handle a push. So no, this would be not good timing for me. And I was like, completely understand. The second one I ordered was like, yeah, but I'm closing my cart till middle of August. So don't like, don't post till then maybe. And so we talked a little bit more and we do have them on deck for August 22nd. So that box is still coming. This is one of the boxes I ordered. And then after those two kerfuffles, I have two in my cart right now that I guess you could say I'm just sitting on. I think I should order them. But anyways, Etsy has subscription boxes. So this is YSM Designs. It is a monthly jewelry subscription at $45 a month and they do offer prepaid discounts. If you use coupon code, this is a tricky one, get ready. YSM Pink Envelope, you can get 10% off the entire store. So she has her own jewelry line there as well. Her reviews are out of this world good and the jewelry looks so beautiful, which is why I chose her. And she said, this is the mystery jewelry subscription and is absolutely perfect as a gift for yourself or to a loved one. Each box will contain products worth $50 or more and a different combination of best-selling products. Some months they will give you choices, other months it is a surprise. They send seasonal pieces, limited edition pieces, and create pieces just for the YSM subscriber. So this is my very first box with them. And I, I love jewelry. Obviously I wear like big earrings and I always have tons of rings on my hands. It's something I love. So I wanted to get some unique pieces. I don't love wearing the same thing as everyone else. I hope this is okay to say, but like I'm not the biggest Kendra Scott fan. I wear select stuff. I have hung out at the store, but I don't want to bump into somebody wearing the same thing as me like over and over. Does that make sense? I hope that that's okay thing to say. So on top is a little note saying thank you for supporting her small business. And this is what it looks like. Let's see what this guy is. Oh, this is my receipt for my order. She did ask some questions like, what type of jewelry? Do you like gold or silver? Do you like um, rings? What is your ring size? When is your birthday? So I did fill out a mini questionnaire in Etsy uh, to, I guess, help curate this. It says pretty things inside. So on top here is this little guy. 
card has a little candy and it says scratch to re scratch to reveal your surprise gift. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's scratch it right now. I love things like this. Okay, I got free gift with a $75 purchase. Let me get all this off of here. So I'm not going to show y'all the code so y'all can't steal my, my coupon. So that is what my little guy revealed. In the back, it has all the terms and conditions, like the expiration date and how to use it. Very cool. Then there's a handwritten note that says, thank you for purchasing and sharing my little business with your viewers. I truly appreciate it. I hope you like the two pieces I made for you and I look forward to partnering with you. Hey, thanks. And then she reiterated the coupon code. So she's one of the ones that I always do. Like I messaged and said, hey, here's what I'm gonna do with this. Are you okay if I do that? And she was like, yes, totally good. So it says, hello, in the box are, oh, statement earrings. I'm not going to read it all. Retail value $42 and a personalized birthstone initial necklace $35. So we've got what? Four, five, six, seven, eighty dollars $80 worth the stuff in here. So I'm not going to lie. The earrings I'm about to pull out, I was so super hoping I was going to get. I saw them on her website and they're freaking, oops, not supposed to say that. They are stinking adorable. Oh my gosh, I got them. Let me pull them out of the wrapper so they'll hang correctly and you guys can see them. Very excited about these. These are so me. They're Monstera earrings, you guys. They're extremely lightweight. They've got a pounded gold medal here. I just love these. Love, love, love these. And when I was getting on and ordering and looking through, I saw these in her shop maybe. I don't remember where. But I was like, okay, I'm going to order the box and hope, hope, hope I'm in the right month to get these. So... At the time of releasing these, I don't know if you can get these. You probably can order them in her shop, but look, they're so cute. I can't believe how lightweight they are. Oh my gosh, this is so good. So these are the Statement Monstera earrings, retail value $42. Looking at the quality of the earring, I do agree that this is a $42 earring. If you were to go into a boutique, it actually probably would be a little more expensive to get these, more towards the $65 range. The quality is fabulous, fabulous. The earring backs fit, so like quite often in these subscription boxes, I will get the earring and I love it, but you put the back on, it just slips off. Not these. It is a really, really great fit. And then look, I am so excited about this next piece. I do have uh, one other pair of monster earrings. They're made of clay, like completely opposite of this. I have never had anything like this. I've always wanted this particular piece since watching Schitt's Creek. And I just got it. And mind you, what did I say I paid for the box? It was, look, $45 for the box. And they have free U.S. shipping. I am freaking excited. That is my initial and that is my birthstone, you guys. And then in here at the bottom, it says jewelry care. Avoid direct contact with perfumes, lotion, water. Remove before showering and bathing. Store jewelry in airtight plastic bag to avoid scratching. All of the basic things. Use a polish cloth to polish. All the normal stuff. But oh my goodness, I cannot believe. Oh, can y'all see the bottom? Where it clasps at the bottom is actually a little pearl. That is amazing attention to detail. Okay, um, I still have my subscription, so boxes will still be coming in. I want to get two or three up on the channel to see a variety of boxes, especially moving into the holidays. She does do season-based earrings and necklaces and rings. So I'm very interested to see what that looks like. And then we'll make a final decision. But first glance at YSM Designs jewelry subscription is amazing. Super, super impressed. Okay. Rocks box. Here is my Rocks Box. Rocks Box comes in a bag like this guy. Rocks Box is a rental or rent to own jewelry subscription. So what do I mean? You can just pay the $21 a month 
and rent the jewelry, meaning you get it, you wear it, when you're done, you put it back in, you ship it back. Free shipping both ways. Or you can rent it, wear it, fall in love with it, use the $21 that you paid to go towards the purchase of any of the items in the box. And so it's $21, it is monthly. Uh, the first five people to subscribe with coupon code, it's another doozy, here we go. Samantha BFF 545, you get your first month of Rock's box for free. It only lets the first five people, this is like just the refer a friend. This is the box. So when I was like, hi, I want to collaborate with you. I ordered a box. They were like, no. And I was like, okay, whatever. <laughs> I'm doing it anyways. Super rebellious. And so um, I believe that refreshes every single month. So the first five people right now, as a release of this video in July, can get the, a free box. Then it resets in August, the first five people, and so on and so forth. You can subscribe at any time, no matter what. And I, I'll try to update the account on that, but that might be tricky. Just give it a try and see what it does. If it lets you do it, then excellent. But Roxbox is a jewelry rental and rent to buy service. You can't bear to part with something you received. The $21 membership fee is a credit towards the purchase. They have 30 plus designers and you get three pieces in every box. Keep them for as long or as short as you want. When you're ready for a new set to be sent, just return and per return or purchase the items. Create your profile and a wish list to be more in control of what you receive. So I didn't want them just sending me anything. So I went in, I created my profile and it said, we recommend that you add 30 things to your wish list right now. So I just went through while drinking some coffee and heart, 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 heart items that I want, and they will source from that list first, meaning I'm gonna get jewelry that I've already said, yeah, that looks cute and I wanna try it. So I ordered this for, which by the way, look how cute the lid is. My kids are keep asking me, are you done with that box yet? Cause they wanna play with it. <laughs> I chose this specifically for 4th of July. So I don't want to really own a bunch of 4th of July. Hello, ring her off. I don't really want to own a bunch of 4th of July jewelry and have to store it and keep up with it, but I wanted it for 4th of July, so I rented it. On top is the jewelry care card and tips and tricks to know. I have, it, it was wrapped really, really cute. Like everything was all perfect and amazing. And then I opened it and wore the jewelry. I've worn it all this month. And then I put it back in here so I could show you guys. But it comes with three little bags that each have the jewelry inside. And then at the bottom is, here's a little bit of a breakout. So it has the retail price, the member price, the total, how the credits work, all of those things. You have a buy three discount. So if I were to keep all of these items, I could use my $21 I paid towards it and I get another $10 off, meaning I would keep all three items for 116. So this is what the little invoice looks like. If I'm like, nope, I don't wanna keep any of it, which is where I'm at. I don't want to keep any of it. I am going to take this bag that they already shipped to me. You can see the resealable. Put the jewelry in here, put the jewelry. Oh, they want the box. So I'll put the jewelry in here, put the jewelry in here. Woo! Put the label on, drop it off. Super, well, I'm not gonna drop it off, it's USPS. I'll put it in the mailbox and I'm done. So it is super, super easy. Let me show you what I selected. Remember, there's hundreds and hundreds, there's probably thousands of options on there. This is what I chose for 4th of July. These cute little studs, they were so cute. I wore them very often. These cute little studs, which you can tell, I don't even think I put them back on the card correctly. Um, because I have multiple piercings in my ear, so this came with, look, those are three different earrings. So I could put them in three different spots, one, two, and three. So that was really, really fun. So this is one earring, by the way. So yeah, I don't know if that's important, but they do have a variety. So I did these, and then I said I wanted a ring. I love wearing rings. I got this ring right here. Didn't love it. Sizing's off a little bit, and it looked worn, in my opinion. You really can't tell once it's on. So let me see. I'm going to slide this guy off. I'm trying to think of the best way to show it to you. There is the ring. It's very comfortable, um, but it fits on a finger that I already have a ring for. So I needed something for like this finger or this finger. 
Uh, the sides are worn. So no crystals are missing, but on the side, it's silver from just being worn by other people. Not a big deal. When you're wearing it like this, even from the bottom, you can't really see it. But Roxbox emails us and emailed me and said, what'd you think of your jewelry? Like, what were your thoughts? I was like, earrings, amazing. Loved them. Ring, okay, nothing's wrong with it, but it had some little bit of wear. The sizing was off. I just wasn't my favorite. Let me pull the email just to make sure I say it right. Hi, I saw that you received the Richmond ring in gold in less than perfect condition. We are so sorry. You should never receive a damaged piece. We've added $10 in forever credit to your account to make up for it. Please return the piece if you don't wish to buy it, blah, 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 normal stuff. They gave me $10 to go shopping with in the online store. They did not have to do that. Anyways, I was incredibly impressed by that. So now that I have showed, y'all, showed? Shown. Shown, y'all. Hmm, that sounds weird to me. The jewelry, I have decided I am not gonna keep any of it because once again, I just wanna rent. So like right here, right now with you guys, because I've been waiting so long to film this video, I would have returned this the day after the 4th of July, but I was saving it for this video and we've had a missing box. I'm going to package this up, ship it out today. I'll get another one next month. When I get another one next month, I'll loop back and share it with you guys. And just see, it does, is Rock's Box as amazing as it was back in the day? Also, I don't think they've increased their prices. Like I remember paying $21 even back in the day, which is like super crazy that they haven't increased their prices. Like actually I don't know how they're doing it. I don't know how they're doing it, but I'm glad they're doing it. And this part's going to be a little bit awkward for me. Emma and Chloe. I'll pop a photo up right here just so we've got like some point of reference. Emma and Chloe is a Parisian jewelry subscription box. They found me in like 2019 or 2020. Maybe it was 2020 or 2021. I don't know. All that, you know, when it just starts blending together, that's where I was during that time. And they sent a couple of boxes that I, I tested before I even shared them with y'all to make sure that they were up to par. <coughs> well, just got into a crazy coughing fit. <clears throat> so my eyes are probably red. All is well. Okay, where was I? Oh, Emma and Chloe had sent boxes to me. Tried them, loved them. Like, I really enjoyed the quality, the uniqueness, everything about the pieces. So I shared them with you guys. If I can find a pass unboxing, I'll pop it up here. All is well. Doing great. Get a few boxes out and they contact me and say, hey, listen, American brand versus the Parisian brand. We're making some splits on the subscription box versus the jewelry. Um, we need to push pause. We need to push pause until we get our stuff together. I was like, thank you. Like, thank you for telling me that. Yeah, let's push pause, get those items split up and delegated, and then we'll loop back. Great. Well, they never loop back. I reached out a couple of times, never heard anything back. I think one, at one point they were just like, no, we're not, no pushes right now. I was like, okay. But I'm looking for jewelry, right? Like I'm looking for subscriptions. So I went ahead and signed back up. It is monthly at $35 a month with free shipping in the U.S. and in Canada. I do not have a coupon code, but each box has jewelry pieces worth $50 to $120 in value from the Atelier Emma and Chloe collection. They're crafted with the same high quality standards as their online store. Boxes arrive between the 5th and 20th of each month. That's a massive gap, but I guess they're shipping from overseas, so that kind of makes sense. They charge you on the first of each month. Okay, that's fine. Things I learned, if you sign up on the last week of the month, like I did, I signed up on the last week of June, you're gonna get back-to-back -back charges. So I was charging like June 20th, and then again on July 1st. No big deal, I want boxes, that sounds great. Um, and it's, you know, $35 <laughs> with free shipping. It's very affordable. Well, I assumed by July, I mean, no later than July 20th, I am filming this on July 20th right now. This is July 20th. I would have at least a June box. I'm trying not to go into another coffin fit here. I wasn't paying attention. I was in here filming with you guys. Realize I've not had any water. I've had a ton of coffee and the AC was set to 76. I'm like sweating. Okay, bring it back in. 
So I never received the June or the July box. I haven't seen anything. I emailed them and said, hey, go ahead and cancel my subscription. I haven't even gotten the boxes, so cancel. Also, where are my boxes? And they did reply saying, we canceled your subscription and they are in route. Like they are coming, your boxes will be shipped, I promise. But I just logged into my account and it says processing. It does not say they've been shipped. So I have two MIA boxes that they promise are coming. So if they do ever come, I guess either way I'm going to loop back, whether I do a chargeback on my card or if I loop back. But this is a first for me. Y'all, I've been doing subscription boxes for six years and very rarely to next to never do I find this situation. However, the C word made things tricky. We've got, right, supply chain issues. We've got companies that are having to fight to stay open, others that need employees to stay open, whatever the reasoning may be, we're bumping into this a little bit more. So I'm not mad at them and I'm, it's really not a big deal. Once again, I am so blessed, we are so blessed that if a problem for us is a missing box, amen, like yay, that is so good. So I'll keep you posted. I have no idea what's going on. I don't, I've not seen any sneak peeks. Their social media isn't real active. The website isn't real active, so I have idea what to anticipate but also super not worried because I think rocks box is gonna hit it out of the park for more of those rental staple pieces like I'm gonna get pumpkin earrings and Christmas tree earrings and all the tacky like holiday based jewelry that I don't want to keep forever and I'm gonna send it right on back to them and then I'm gonna keep my YSM for these truly like gorgeous unique pieces that are those standalone like when we're going to dinner or like I'd love to go to propagating like classes with my kids, I'm going to wear my more elegant pieces from them. So even though this did not quite turn out how I had hoped, I think it turned out really, really well with those other two boxes. So look for those to pop up more over the next few months as we watch them grow. Okay, you guys, if you have not already, share me the pink envelope YouTube with a friend. Um, that's how we get the word out about what we're doing over here. There's so many people who don't even realize that subscription boxes are out there like this. Um, they're struggling because they're stuck at home with multiple little kids and they would love to get some new jewelry, but in their mind, it's like, how would I ever have time to get me and them ready and drive up to what a Nordstrom tar? Like how would like, how, how this, this is how. So introduce them to the channel so they can find different things like yoga clothes and wine subscriptions and I'm working on a tennis shoe subscription. We'll see. I, I need to see the product first before I put it on here. I test all products before they come on here. This is this is not a, a reviews and directory site. Everything on this channel is very curated before I share it with you guys. So we'll see if that pops up. But share with a friend to hook them up. If you have not already subscribed, it's the fastest and easiest way to see what's up to grab the coupon codes. Um, if you want early access, join the Ask the Pink Envelope Facebook group. I'm going to post this video in there first. Why? Because that's my family. Those are my people. This is what we do life with. So they get the hookup on a lot of videos first, a lot of info first, before it trickles out to the masses. So if you want to be in that group, head over there. The link is down below in the description. I hope that you guys are having an absolutely amazing summer. And if you subscribe to my channel, I'm going to see y'all later. Bye y'all.